Welcome back to Zith Meme, I'm Jay Silver, and you're probably wondering what there is to talk about with Poop's Color Garden. There's a bit you unpack here. You see, I, um... For those of you who don't know, I played Poop's Color Garden on the channel, uh, finished last year. Uh, like, very early on. I think it might actually be coming up, if not just past a year now, since I finished that game. Um... It still to this day is one of my most consistently successful series on the channel. Uh, it had arguably the most active comment section of any really any any video I really had aside from maybe the anniversaries or um, or nutball. Uh, but the reason I wanted to bring it up is because although I did finish it. Um, People have been asking me to play the second game, and I intend to. But the Pooh's Killer Garden series affected me in a bit of a different way, and I kind of want to talk about that because uh, towards the end of last year, I got a recommendation to play World of Vampire, and it is downloaded on my computer. I do intend to make videos about it pretty soon. Um, so I, I went to go download World of Vampire one day. And I went on to the, the, the game site, um, the website that they have for all, all of their games. And it was around the time that they were celebrating their fourth anniversary of Poof's Killer Garden. One of the games, I can't remember which, but it was like the, I think it was the fourth anniversary of it, I'm pretty sure. Uh, regardless, it was some kind of year anniversary, I don't know, guys, I'm sorry. Regardless, they made a video. They dedicated a whole video to having watched a bunch of creators play Poof's Killer Garden and made a compilation of some of their best reactions to it. And I was in that. I was. You, you can still see it on the, on the website. If you go to the website, you'll see it. It's still there. And I'm not making this video because uh, I'm trying to gloat about the fact that I was in the compilation. But I didn't have any idea while I was making the series that the creator would be watching it. You know, I, it, it never crossed my mind. And it's, it's crazy because at the same time, that was at a very weird point in my YouTube career. And it was a series that I didn't expect to work with the community as it did. Um, and it's crazy because looking back on it, I was, I had some fun with it, but I was also overly critical about it. And the fact that the creator took the time to even just go through my videos and take some moments and give me credit for it, that's incredible. Props to them. Um, I, I didn't really have a plan with the end goal of what I wanted to say. By the end of this episode, I just know I wanted to address it. I, after watching that, I feel kind of bad. I really do. I don't, um, I don't think I was fair in a lot of what I said. Even if, you know, it wasn't all that bad, I actually haven't gone back and watched the series in a while, and I probably won't. But I know I was really critical about the game. Um, and I do, I, I do feel kind of bad about how I, how I talked about it, just from what I remember. Now I am going to play the other games, I assure you of that. I, uh, I've started getting comments about playing Poos Killer Garden 2 again. I'll be playing World of Vampire first, and then Five Nights at Fuckboys 3, and then Poos Killer Garden 2. So it will probably be, I mean, plans can change. 
There's a good chance I could probably do Poops Kill Garden 2 and Finance of Fuckboys 3 simultaneously. I just don't want to overload the channel with RPG content uh, because, you know, there's a lot more games to play. Um, and also, when I have too many series running at the same time, stuff gets lost in the shuffle. If the creator of Poops Killer Garden is watching this, I'm sorry. I really am. I've talked about it before that I actually had a brief uh, interaction with the creator of Poops Killer Garden via Game Jolt, and that is true. Um, I, I just, I feel bad. I really do. Um, and I, you know, I, I just, I want to do right by the community, by the community and by, by the, the game developer. Because it was a solid game. I just had problems with that at the time because I was comparing it to too many other things. Um, and I was a little bit stressed out with it overall. I do intend to be more professional with the, with the next one, um, and I am actually looking forward to playing the next one. Um, yeah, I, I don't know, <laughs> it seems like a weird video to make because I didn't kind of, I don't have like a point, there's no period, there's no exclamation mark at the end of this video. Usually when I make a vlog, there is that kind of, okay, this is the end point. Now I can end off. This one doesn't really have that. I'm kind of, I'm just, I'm making this video to talk about it because it, you know, watching the video that the, the creator made really affected me. And because I, I don't know, I, I don't, I don't know. Um, but I do assure you, most, uh, more Killer Garden is coming to the ch to the channel in the future. Um, it's just, it's gonna take a, a little while. It really is. I mean, I was supposed to, for those of you who want to know, like, a little bit of background knowledge, I was supposed to have already started World of Vampire. It was supposed to be, um part of the 12 days of gaming leading up to the fifth anniversary of the channel uh but i miscalculated how many videos i'd made and so it, there was no room for it uh so i i yeah that, that was a fuck up on my part <laughs> um yeah anyway um i i hope that didn't come off too much as clickbait <laughs> I, I really, I'm not trying to like just draw in the poof community because I want more views. I don't care about that. I literally, I just want to address the fact that, you know, the creator acknowledged me. I wanted to address the fact that I do, in, there is a future for Poof's Killer Garden on the channel. And I want to address what I was doing next. And I wanted to address how bad I felt for how critical I was. And I covered all those points as uncertain as it may have sounded. So, um, yeah. Anyway, that, that's going to wrap it up here for this this quick episode of whatever the fuck this is. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Uh, this has been the Zenith Medium. I am Jay Silver. And um, I don't know if you want to stick around or something. There's more gaming, more vlogs, whatever else comes. I'll see you all very, very soon.